I'm Anita, and we're back in Twisted Wonderland. So, who's excited for the second anniversary? I, I know I'm, I've been pretty dang excited. So I'm hoping this isn't too obvious, but um, I thought I would do this anyway, just in case if um, you're new to the game or haven't done uh, a stamp mission yet, or stamp missions yet, I think is what they call them. Um, and, Cause that would break my heart if you missed out on <laughs> lab coat Grim. I mean, he's adorable. <laughs> I can't stand it. His little lab coat and lab gloves and glasses. <laughs> he's adorable. So hopefully this is helpful if you're like me and have to have him in your roster. So, <laughs> the first thing, I always forget and delay doing this, so start the story. <laughs> you won't, you can't get access to him at all unless you start the story. So start the story right away so that you can um, get him as soon as possible. Cause I'm, yeah, I'm pretty, you have to clear so many chapters before as a requirement before he will officially join your roster. Uh, oh, so the next piece of advice I have for you, check, or don't forget to check this. I try and check this as often as you can. Don't forget about it. <laughs> uh, you know, it's out of sight, out of mind, at least I know for me. And you don't want to miss out on these great items. So if I were you, I would, I would, um, I would check and keep up on this like crazy, especially because some of these items, you know, they're star shards, I think that's their name. You're going to need loads of these for to get him because, so just this card alone, you will need 500 pink cans of tuna. And two, um, also why I wanted to do this, so, if you not only have your heart set on getting him in his lab coat, the card with him in his lab coat, um, in the shop, you can get, if you missed out on the first anniversary, um, Grim in his ribbon, you can get it now. So you're going to need a lot of star shards to get both if you have your heart set on both. So, here is going to be the tricky part with getting Grim um, in this event. Like I was just saying, you're going to need a lot of star shards to get um, enough pink cans of tuna. Plus, if um, I know for me personally, I, I got Grim actually the first anniversary. I figured out how to do it. I was going to get him no matter what. He's like one of my top five favorite characters in the game. But I know I want Pete cans of tuna for at least these keys. So I actually go over um, a lot of like what these items are and what you should, what items you should prioritize and stuff. And um, I'll try and link it. Um, what, what I wish I knew about items and Twisted Wonderland. It's something like that. So, you can check that out for in more detail, but if I were you, I would, uh, hopefully you have some of these stocked up, and so you won't want to use them for this if you have your heart set on getting and having Grim in his, or Grim in his lab coat card. What did, what are they calling it? <laughs> Actually, I should find out. Um, if you want him fully powered and at least especially in your roster. But I'm pretty sure, and I remember, I'm pretty sure last year you could only upgrade him pretty much during the event. I'm guessing that I'm pretty sure they'll do that again for this event. So you will want a ton of star shards to be able to do that. If you, or to help you out with that a little bit. So if you go to the shop, if you go into the exam token shop, you can buy some to get you by. 
if you if you need some, you don't even need to use gems to do that. I would start there first, and then I would go. Oop, wrong place. I would go here, and I would I would spend gems to get these because you're getting more than just the star shards. You're also getting the keys. So I would go there first. I would only probably use I would only use the gems as the last resort and if you really really have your heart set on getting Grim for this event, I would start with um, the st getting the star shards elsewhere first if I were you. You have plenty of time. I'm pretty sure this goes to February 4th, so you have time to do that. But here's why you need so many star shards. So you don't just need to you, or to, to earn pink hands of tuna. You, <laughs> you will want and need them for spells. So I actually filmed this once already <laughs> and I messed up. I, I accidentally didn't push record. <sighs> so here I am again. <laughs> You find that funny, Grim? He's laughing at me. Did you see that? He's laughing at me. <laughs> You're such a snot, Grim. <laughs> so hopefully I can explain this well because, like I said, I messed up. So, well, first, um, and if I, were, if I were you, I would start with spell one, and I would get it if it says to get, especially if it says to get it to level five first down here, I would start with that first especially because most of the time they require that in the stamp missions so I would do that first or I do that first and then what I do from there is I so then I do so then I so after I finish getting spell one to level five especially if it says it will give me benefits down here if I get it to level five then though I work on spell two and especially if spell two says also it, I will get benefits if I reach it to level five so then that I have both of these to level five so that I can at least use the card if I don't in time get these to level 10. But I can at least use the card if I have both of them to um, level five. So I would do that if I were you so you can at least use the card and it, it can get you pretty far on just level five if it says down below that it can, or that you can um, get benefits from level five, especially if you can uncap it, groovify it, and then get the card level up. So if I were you, I would do that first, and then when I, you know, then work on getting it to level 10 when you can. So I'm not sure. I feel I feel like this is only for the event. There's a special. I would take advantage of this if I were you, especially with Grim, because you'll get extra benefits and stuff. You'll level him up so much. Oops, so much faster if you take advantage of the special lessons. You know, obviously, if Grim's not your if you, you don't have your heart set on Grim, probably use another character that you have your heart um, set on leveling up. But if you do have your heart set on getting Lab Co. Gr Grim, I would use that for. I would use. I would use the special on him for that. For that. Mm, too. So of recording this, um, I'm not sure if it will stay this way I feel like it will um so I'll tell you just just in case so yesterday of filming this where silver was grim was I mean, obviously it was different characters and all of these um it was like 
It's like... Ah, shoot. I really don't remember. But Grim was at the end here where you could level him up in this area. Well, he's not there, obviously, of filming this today. So if I were you, I would check here and if you see Grim in this section, level him up here. Because I would... I'm not sure, but I wouldn't be surprised if they... Um, if they don't have that after the event is over. So if I were you, I would take advantage of that. All right, so I'm not sure if I mentioned this or not. So check here very often because this also, I, I think I forgot to mention, I'm pretty sure I did. So this is just round one. So they'll have, I think a total of three for this. <laughs> don't quote me on that. But, so you will want to check this and not forget to do um, the stamp missions. Especially if you need the star shards, uh, or and especially the keys. <laughs> so check in this section often. Um, I know I'll I keep I'll forget to look and or come to this page and look here, especially because we won't get the uh, get chapter three for a while. Yeah, so don't forget to check the stamp missions. You don't want to miss out on those. Alright, I think, I hope I haven't left anything out, so comment below, are you totally going to get Labco Grim? I'm totally going to get Labco Grim, I have to have him. Uh, comment below too, so there's a lot of cool banners going on right now, so comment below who you had, who you've had your eye on and who you're going after in the banners. Also in the shop too, so what uh, event cards are you going after? who you had your eye on that you um, have to have and or to uh, who in um, which birthday boy are you wanting and after have your eye on because now you can get them in the shop so comment below so if you loved this one you'll love the next one on screen see you over there